All right, guys. It is Friday evening. I just busted to get home and uh, grabbed the Zephyr Magnum. So that's a bow that I just put out a video of me getting that set up with some hunting arrows. It's a bow that has been sitting in my closet for probably 20 years. But I've got it together and we're gonna go try to kill a deer with that tonight. So I'm heading to a place that's got a good amount of does that uh, could definitely use one taken out. I could use one at home and I don't know. That's really all I've got. I'm gonna go get in a tree. I'm excited to bring that bow and see what happens. My game plan is the first mature doe that ends up in range, I'm gonna take her and just see what you really need when it comes to a bow. Can you get one from a yard sale that fits you and make it work? Or do you need to go spend $2,000? We'll find out, let's see. Here we are. This is a really pretty little spot. And I know there's a bunch of deer in the area, so I just gotta get one within about 25 yards. My max is cut considerably using this, but I just haven't practiced with it enough. But I'm very confident out to 25 yards. It's one of those evenings that everything feels good, if you know what I mean. Like the weather's perfect, the wind is gonna die down here. It's just a good feeling day. I think we'll have some activity. Stick around, we'll find out.
had me nervous. Big Maturio was bullying these other fawns. And I knew she'd come right back when she moved them off. And sure enough, she ran them out. Came right back. I shot her five yards. I think I heard her fall down. Let me see if I can see my arrow. Yeah, it's laying there, broken half. Which is good. It means it hit right on the back of that shoulder and she kicked it. <clears throat> Complete pass through. Zephyr Magnum. I'll tell you what. That thing blew through her as good as any arrow I've ever shot. You can see where it's stuck deep into the ground there. Wow. So that'll do it. Well, I'm gonna walk out of here. see blood that I can follow, I will, but if I can't, I'll go get some lights, come back, still got some time before dark, but I just don't see blood very well. so that angle was perfect. Well, two does down on the year. I'm done shooting does. I'm gonna retire the Zephyr Magnum. But, I'm so excited. Two does down, it's October 16th. That's a really nice mature doe, and I've wanted to get one with that bow for a long time. Now I don't have to worry about meat as much. She'll do a good job filling the freezer. Alright guys, I've got her out here. And I'm just getting ready to field dress her. I'm gonna snap a picture, load her up, take her home, hang her up, skin her, quarter her. As you are all well aware, there's a lot of work involved when you get one down, but it's worth it. And I'm very thankful for this animal. So I'm gonna go ahead and get that picture and then I'll check in with you guys at the shop when we get this girl weighed. Thing. <clears throat> so me and my buddies are in a doe contest 
I've got the first entry of 103 and this one's more for sure. Oh, maybe not. Hold on. 101. Well, I thought she was a lot bigger, but she's not. She's two pounds less. So 103 is still the winner so far. That'll always change later in the season when they get more fat on them. All right, guys. I guess I'll end the video here. Got her hung up. I'm going to go to town. I've got to get some ice and... When I come back, I'll skin her out, quarter her, and then I throw the quarters on ice, and then I'll process it this weekend. But thank you guys again for watching. That was a lot of fun. I've wanted to shoot a deer with that bow for years. Like I said, I've had it 15, 20 years. And so I finally got that done, and that feels pretty good. And to have another deer in the freezer is awesome too, because check this out. Doe number one is in there, but I've already eaten quite a bit of it and that isn't going to get me through so happy to have that adam thank you so much for the arrows they worked great i did snap one so you know if you got another spare i could maybe i'll break her back out but uh thank you again buddy i really do appreciate that thank you so much for watching i'll catch you on the next one